71. And after these things, I saw four angels standing on the four, four corners of the earth, holding the four winds of the earth. The four corners of the earth means over the whole planet, right? That the wind should not blow on the earth, nor on the sea, nor on any tree. And I saw another angel ascending from east, having the seal of the living God, and he cried with a loud voice to the four angels to whom it was given to hurt the earth and the sea. Saying, hurt not the earth, neither the sea, nor the trees, till we have sealed the servants of our God in their foreheads. All right, the servants of the God, that's, that's the elected Israelites, okay? That's the Israelites, the Lord's people is the Israelites. And the Lord did not come to save all nations, all right? And we're about to prove it right here. We're gonna prove right here in Revelation. The Lord did not come for all nations. No, it came for the nation of Israel. And I heard the number of them which were sealed, and there was sealed a hundred and forty and hundred and forty-four thousand. Now this is the elect. Alright, this is it's gonna tell you it's the first fruits. Alright. This is really the only people the Lord has uh given knowledge to. The only people that got any kind of knowledge is the elect. Alright. Keep going. Let me read this precept. Right, go ahead. I say eleven eleven, and it shall come to pass in that day that the Lord shall set his hand again to the second time to recover the remnant of his people which shall be left from Assyria and from Egypt and from Pathros and from Cush and from Elam and from Shinar and yeah. from Hamath and Dang. from the islands of the sea. That's all kind of different nations. It said Egypt, it said Israelites were scattered uh, amongst the, the four corners of the earth. I mean, there's Israelites living in every nation. It just said the Israelites were scattered in Egypt. Okay, back in ancient Egypt, it opened the city of Alexandria. That was all Israelites living up in there. You know what I'm saying? It was all over the place. They said they had Israelites living in Elam. Okay, that's the East India. So you got Israelites to this day living down there in East India. Probably be a lot of their good singers and stuff. You know, they make a lot of movies down there. Uh, uh, yeah, what is that? And I heard the number of them which were sealed. Now this is the number of those who were sealed. Now this is the, the who was sealed. That's the Lord's servants. That's the saints. They just want everybody sealed, okay? So this is 100% proof that the Lord's people is Israel. Keep going. And not, you know, ain't no Esau in there. Uh, ain't no Esau. Esau can't be saved, okay? No other nation. Hamites can't be saved. No Japhites can be saved. Okay, none of them heathens, all right? They don't need to be saved anyway. They're, they're heathen. And I heard the number of them which were sealed, and there was there were sealed a hundred and forty-four thousand of all the tribes of the children of Israel. All the tribes of the children of Israel. Now this did not say all the tribes of every last nation on earth. It did not say that. Okay, it, is, it, is, it specifies Israel. Okay, in Israel in Hebrew that means. Uh, pronounce Yasharala. Okay, that means he's a he's a prince of God. That's what it means. Because the prince of God means we're the sons of God. Because we're the sons of God. Keep going. Did the Lord the one y'all call Jesus? Yahweh Shai. He was an Israelite from the tribe of Judah. Keep going. Of the tribe of Judah were sealed 12,000. So there's 12,000 sealed of Judah, the tribe of Judah, the nation of Israel. Keep going. Of the tribe of Reuben 
or sell 12,000. So that's Reuben, those more Israelites keep on. Of the tribe of Gad. The tribe of Gad. <laughs> the 12,000 of Gad, they all Israelites. You ain't hear no, no other nations in here. It's all Israel. Keep going. Of the tribe of Esher, were still 12,000. Uh, Israel, keep going. The tribe of Bethlehem. Yeah, Naphtali. Naphtali, were still 12,000. Yep. Of the tribe of Manassas, were still 12,000. Of the tribe of Simeon, were still 12,000. Of the tribe of Levi, were still 12,000. Of the tribe of Issachar, were still 12,000. Of the tribe of Zebulon, were still 12,000. Of the tribe of Joseph, well, that was Ephraim, right? Oh, yeah. Well, just, yeah, you had Joseph. Now, Joseph on. Of the tribe of Joseph, were still 12,000. Of the tribe of Benjamin, were still 12,000. After... All, right, all right, hold on a second. So they just told you everybody that was sealed. Not, not now. That's the Lord's servants right there. Okay, that's who the Lord is dealing with. He didn't say Esau was sealed. He didn't say, you know, he didn't say Ham was uh, sealed. None of them heathens was sealed. All right, this is very clear. All right. Back of that brother like black is trying to say that a few of them even might go make it. Not, not one. Not one. Not a cool one. You know. Well, because he only thinks that Edomite goes somewhere with white skin. Right. That, that, white dude, skin that dude's simple. He's retarded. He's a nigga. Yeah, that's a, he's a retarded. He's a nigga. You know what I'm saying? He's a stupid nigga. All right, because well, this is going to explain. Keep going. After this, I behold and lo, a great multitude. A great multitude. <laughs> Keep going. Which no man could number. Which no man can number. Just like, a, hey, get Jose at 1 in 10. Real quick, would you? Uh, yeah, go ahead, read that again. After this, I beheld, 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 and lo, a great multitude, which no man could number. Which no man can number. Of all nations and kindreds and people and tongues. I, I said of all nations, okay? All and, nations and, and it just people. told you who was sealed. It just told you before. This is talking about Israel, okay? When you start reading in Revelation, the seventh chapter, it starts off talking about Israel, those who were sealed, and it talks about those who were sealed all through the chapter. And this is explaining to you where those, the, the elect are, okay? This is telling you. It told you who was sealed, all the tribes of Israel, 12,000 people. The people died then. Yeah. yeah, I hope so. Loud piece of shit. Loud piece of shit. So go ahead with that. Read that loud, man. You got his asshole away. Look at this big faggot on that mo- Look at that faggot on that moped, bro. Look at that Look like a big weirdo, man. He actually drives around looking like that. That shit actually- What a What a loser, man. This a big dude, man. The number of the children of Israel, okay, of Israel, not of any other nation. Keep going. Yet the number of the children, yet the number of the children of Israel shall be as the sand of the sea. They shall be as the sand of the sea. Now you can't count all the sand, all the little grains of sand on the seashore. It's impossible. Keep going. Which cannot be measured. Can't be measured. Can't number. You can't measure. That's not. You can't get a measurement. You, you know what I'm saying? Keep going. And it shall come to pass that in the place where it was said unto them, Ye are not my people, there it shall be said unto them, Ye are the sons of the living power. It said, we, we are the sons of God. Just like Romans 8, what's that? Romans 8, 14. It says that we are the sons of God. That's what it says. Go back to that Revelation. Read that part again. Revelation 7 and 9. 
After this, I beheld, and lo, a great multitude, which no man could number. Which no man could number. That's saying the same thing as Hosea, when it was talking about Israel. So, so this is talking about Israel. You can't get around it. Keep going. Of all nations and kindreds. Of all nations and kindreds. Okay, that means Israel is scattered among all these other nations, and they look like the other nations. So that's why it says all nations and kindreds. Because you have Israelites that, that, that are black people. Okay, you they have dark black skin. You got Israelites with white skin, okay? Light skin, look, look like a so-called uh, white person. You have Israelites that look like Chinese people, and they speak Chinese. You got Israelites scattered in Japan. Like, who the hell you think's making all them video games in Japan? Ain't no goof making that shit. You ever played Metal Gear Solid? What's your boy, Hideo Kojima? That dude's gotta be an Israelite, man. Yeah, that's a badass fucking game. That's my all-time yeah. favorite game right there. Next to check it. So, it, it's a, Israel scattered among all nations, man. Oh, dude, I got another good, yeah. Oh, just keep, uh, keep, keep going. Yeah, that's cool. That's good to keep reading it over and over. Revelation 7 and 9. After this, I beheld and lo, a great multitude, which no man could number, of all nations and kindreds and people and tongues, stood before the throne and before the Lamb, clothed, clothed with white robes. So they was clothed with white robes. You can't say these are heathens, because they said they come from all nations. The heathens ain't clothed in white robes, because the white robes, that represents purity, represents cleanliness, you know what I'm saying? It represents being baptized, that's what that represents. Keep going. And palms in their hands. They got palms, that represents peace, okay? Keep going. And cry with a loud voice saying, salvation to our God, which sits upon his throne and on and unto the Lamb. It says salvation to our God. What God is that talking about? That's the God of Israel. That's Yahweh Baha Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Okay? That's clear as day. So, it, it, nowhere in the Bible did it say the heathens was, was calling on the name of the Lord. It never said that. And it said these people that were scattered from among all nations, and even taught, it said people from all kindreds and all tongues. That means they speak, Israelites are scattered among all nations. They speak all languages. Name a language on some other side of the planet. Mongolian, Chinese, yeah, yeah, right. Japanese, Russian. You got Israelites in Russia. Zulu. Oh, yeah, you even got Shaka Zulu motherfuckers who ain't really heathens down there. Yeah. Them, uh, you got Israelites got trapped up inside the Congo somehow. Especially in Johannesburg. Oh, yeah, Johannesburg. Yeah, Jake's all over here. Yeah, yeah South Africa. 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 Yeah. You got a lot of Irish down here, too. Yep, yep. Yeah, oh, yeah, the Irish, a lot of them are Israelites. They're scattered among the whole damn earth. They said there's more Irish in America than there is in Ireland. You know what I mean? That's crazy. Uh, keep going. Revelation 7 and 10. And cried with a loud voice, saying, Salvation to our God, which sitteth upon the throne, and unto the Lamb. And all the angels stood round about the throne, and about the elders, and the four beasts, and fell before the before the throne on their faces and worship God. So that must be a magnificent place to be right there. You know what I'm That's you up in the holy they was up in the holy of holies. You gonna tell me a heathen is up in the holy of holies? You know what I'm saying? You gonna tell me the Lord is gonna let you be up the That don't even sound right. That don't even sound right. Yeah, he's not even let the wicked of his own people sin No. This is all about Yeah, it's more proof that the Lord's only dealing with Israel. Let me read this real quick. Second Ezra was 13 and uh, 12. Afterward, I saw the same man come down from the mountain and call unto him another peaceful multitude. And there came much people unto him, whereof some were glad, some were sorry. Some of them were bound, and others some brought of them that were offered. Then was I sick through great fear, and I wake and said, it goes into talking about that great number of people getting that great multitude, you know what I'm saying? Yep. That's Israel. Because Israel is the, the most, we the most numerous people on the earth. The scripture said you can't number us, okay? There's so many, because first of all, the people doing the census, the United States government, they don't know where all the Israelites are. They don't even know what the hell is going, they don't even know where the hell they at. Hell, David was punished for trying to count Israel at one time. Yep, that's, yeah, you're right. It's against the laws of the Bible. You're not allowed to count Israel. That's right. You read the Bible? You believe in the Bible? Hey, brother, you believe in the Bible? No, uh, 
You don't believe in the Bible? The tear? No, a friend of mine said that uh, the tear? every time that they take scissors, some type of uh, disease to jump on after they take the scissors. Let me ask you something, brother. Why don't you believe in the Bible? Uh, you, know, you just you just turn not to believe in it. Yeah, yeah. That's why the Lord is punishing our people right now for yeah. non-belief. Yeah. But you're an atheist. Yeah. You're an atheist. That's a religion itself. Yeah. You're gonna have your share in the, that pit of fire when the yeah. Lord comes. Pit of fire. Yeah. Done. Yeah. Gonna be part of that. Uh, that, 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 that great barbecue that's coming. That's why barbecue will stay at the bottom of the barrel because of that. You have to the fire barrel. All these years you've been here, man, you don't. All this hell, I mean, you ain't catching no hell here in America, man. Yeah, yeah. Well, why do you think you're catching hell? You're catching hell for a reason because there's a God out there punishing you. Remember, look up, you're going to see them missiles coming. Okay. One day. I mean, one day. You're going to look up, you're going to see them coming like, wow. <laughs> All right, man. I think he on some juice. He on some medication. Just an old fool. He told us That's to take care when you told him to eat a missile. That's yeah. just an old fool. He juiced out. Yeah, that dude's gone. He's out of it. Old idiot. He's in another dimension. Revelation 7 and 12. He didn't have a clue what he was saying. I think he, he's not even sure where he's at. He don't even know what's going on. Now go ahead. Okay. That's, 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 <laughs> Revelation 7 and 11. And all the angels stood around about the throne and about the elders and the four beasts and fell before the throne of their faces and worshiped God, saying, Amen, blessing the glory and wisdom and thanksgiving and honor and power and might be unto our God forever and ever. Amen. And one of the elders answered saying unto me, what are these which are arrayed in white robes? Now this is talking about that great multitude of all, the, from all nations, from, that was, those Israelites who were scattered from among all nations. All right, there's a great multitude of people. Keep going. And whence came they, and I said unto him, sir, thou knowest, and he said to me, these are they which came out of a great tribulation. These are the people that came out of great tribulation. That's the Israelites. You can read Deuteronomy 28 and they'll learn all about that tribulation. Keep going. And, and now you can see what happened to Israel when they was in captivity in uh, under the Egyptians. That's why the Lord had to send Moses in there to deliver the Israelites to the Red Sea. Keep going. And I said unto him, Sir, thou knowest. And he said to me, These are they which came out of a great tribulation and have washed their robes Just and like made they, them white in the blood of the Lamb. Oh, yes, yeah, so they washed their robes. You're going to tell me that means they've been purified, they've been baptized in the blood of the Lamb. That's why you hear people talking about the blood of Jesus. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's the blood of your house shot. Uh, keep going. Therefore, are they before the throne of God and serve him day and night in his temple. So that you know, where were you reading the Bible where it said heathens are serving the most high? Now, this is all talking about Israel, man. It said they're clean, they dress in white robes. And he that sitteth on the throne shall dwell among them. They shall hunger no more. They shall hunger no more. Keep on. Neither thirst anymore. They, they see it. Right, right now, Esau, he's not he's not hungering right now. Okay, he's, his belly's full. So you know it's not talking about Esau. All these other heathens you see, they, they ain't hungry. They got everything they need. So it's talking about Israel. Keep going. Neither shall the sun light on him, nor any heat. For the land which is in the midst of the throne shall feed them, and shall lead them in on two living fountains of water. Yeah, because the, 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 the lamb is going to feed them, okay? That's what that's in green pasture. Oh, uh, just like the word pastor, a real pastor, because the pastor comes from the word pasture, okay? And so yeah, that means you're feeding the sheep. And the Lord said, my sheep know my voice. The sheep 
out there eating all kind of uh, weeds and shit. Yeah. Oh, so you got your pastor. Yeah. Eating all kind of fast. We she eat, ain't supposed to eat food. Eating GMO. GMO. Right, eating right. candy. Right. right. Eating sugar. And that's what these pastors are doing. Feeding the, feed the, feed the, feed the sheep GMO. Yeah. Genetically modified over Yeah, that's pretty much what they're doing. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's just modified. modified it ain't natural. You know what I'm saying? Geometric. <laughs> yeah, that's what they're doing. Yeah, that's pretty much what they're doing. Yeah, because they're modifying that. They're not teaching the truth. All, none of these uh, churches are talking about Israel. And then none of them can tell you who the children of Israel are. We know who the children of Israel are. All right? We, we know Israel when we see Israel. I was, watch, uh, I was watching that video with them, uh, Medusa was out here last week. And she was yelling at you when that bitch was out here last week. Medusa? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That black bitch. Yeah, because they were so simple, they didn't understand that Israelites could become a more than one color. Uh, they so stupid, they couldn't figure that out. You know, everybody's stupid like that. You know, everybody's retarded. You, you can't, I mean, it's really a simple thing to understand that Israel scattered among all nations. We the greatest people on earth. That's really a simple thing, but you can't. Yeah, some people are just stupid as hell, man. They can't get it. Pussy points at every time. You just see them. Oh. So ain't none of your, ain't none of your preachers out here. Your preachers will tell you that you're a gentile. You go to church. Let's say you, you're a gentile. It, it, well, that means you're not getting saved. That's what it means. If you're really a Gentile, that means the Lord's not coming for you. He's not dealing with you at all. Well, if you think about it, they is. Well, really, they are. That means they're really unclean. They're foreigners. You know what I mean? Scripture speaks about them. Yeah, we do. You got to. Because remember, the Lord didn't say all of Israel was still the first. Because you got the first fruits coming in. And that's the elect. Because right now, in the kingdom, all of Israel is going to be, be saved. But on this side, the Lord's only dealing with the elect. That's right. He ain't dealing with a whole bunch of people. The Lord ain't dealing with the majority of people. He ain't dealing with you, man. Here you go. This is first, uh, first Thessalonians uh, 4 and 5. Not uh, the, uh, in the less of conspicuous, even as the Gentiles which know not the Most High. So the Bible said the Gentiles know not the Most High. So we know in Revelation that great multitude were uh, Israelites. Because they knew the Most High. They was praising His name. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And He just, where, where was that scripture at? That was in the New Testament. Was that Galatians? That's right, First Thessalonians. Oh, Thessalonians. Yeah. That's in Thessalonians. That's a New Testament. Let me read some more of this. So go, All right. That no man go be young and defraud his brother in any matter, because that the Lord is the avenger of all such, as we also have forewarned you and testified. For the Most High have not called us unto uncleanness. So unclean, like a Gentile is unclean. So the Lord ain't dealing with no, no uncleanliness, you know what I'm saying? Because the Gentiles, they're they're unclean, they're uncircumcised. That's right. Okay. That's right. You, I heard, look, I was watching a, a documentary on YouTube yesterday on, on child molestation, and this one motherfucker, Edomite, was so far gone in the shit that he circumcised himself with a dull pocket knife man. with no anesthesia or nothing, just ripped his dick all apart. Oh, man. But they know, do, no, that, what was it on? In the Indiana, in the University of Indiana, was studying this motherfucker was down low without reporting to the police. Was, was and dude was coming reporting to him. The, the professors, the dude, dude was reporting to the professors like, I did this when I was molested this time. You know what I mean? He was reporting every time he molested this time. Hey, there goes the crow. Get that evidence from the university. The state or government, whatever.